Where previously most people take health for granted, now most people make a conscious effort to stay healthy. Part of staying healthy is knowing the benefits of exercise, living according to appropriate lifestyle habits, healthy dietary choices and generally keeping stress levels as low as possible. Get all the info you need here. Staying healthy is a very good position to be in, as the opposite of that would be tracking in and out of hospitals with one medical condition or another. This cannot only be depressing but can also severely dent the wallet, as medical bills can be rather expensive to handle. Being able to enjoy life without the burden of popping pills and visiting doctors every so often is definitely a better option to live by. Extensive research has shown that many medical conditions are the result of poor eating habits coupled with the lack of consistent exercise and a stress-filled life. Therefore taking the time to seriously address these issues before they turn into problems is one way of keeping healthy. It would certainly be lighter on the wallet, when the individual is not bogged down with medical bills and the trauma of having to face a terminal condition. Poor dietary plans usually cause less that optimum body conditions, where the clogging, damaging and overworking of internal body systems can then contribute to poor health conditions. Therefore instead of having to deal with the probability of managing poor health, the better option would be to start on a healthy diet plan, a regular exercise regimen and a stress-free mindset. Having some knowledge and education on the benefits of healthy living style, will not benefit the individual, if information learnt is not put into practice. As the human body naturally deteriorate as it ages all steps should be taken to ensure the process is not helped along by poor health. There are a lot of reasons why there are various diets available to the general public, and most of these safer diets are designed around the importance of nutrient content. Nutrition is the key factor to a healthy body system which is able to function at its optimum capabilities and also help to maintain an ideal positive overall health condition. One way of ensuring the right nutrition intake is practiced, that the measured amount considered being enough for the individual is to ensure the diet plan includes elements such as carbohydrates, fats, fibers, minerals, proteins, vitamins and water. Good nutrition intake is even more beneficial to specific parts of the body and not just the overall body system. The following are just some ways of how specific the benefits can be, the heart of course is the essential core of the entire body system, therefore being of such important as needs the special attention so that as cab function at its optimum, thus the need for good nutritional support. The bones are basically the elements that keep everything together. Here to there is a need for good nutritional support as without optimum bone density and quality the body will experience a lot of connective problems. Energy for the body is derived from the daily food intake, and there is a need to ensure this food is nutritionally based so that the relevant minerals and vitamins can be dispersed within the system to churn out the necessary energy source for the body's energy needs. With good nutrition the human body can function at its optimum and basically be able to last and withstand any adverse effects the surroundings may throw at it. Often people disregard the importance of good nutrition and this is especially prevalent among the youngsters who seem to think their health is infallible. Everyone has a different take on the good and bad attributes of having a diet plan low in calorie count. However it would be better for the individual to explore the best calorie plan that is suited for his or her own lifestyle rather than to adopt just any calorie plan in the hope of staying at an optimally healthy level. Calories are not bad for the body, in fact they are a necessity as they function as the provider of the energy source for the daily body's needs. The problem lies in the actual intake of calories, where the intake is more than the usage of energy, thus contributing to a high percentage of the unused calorie being stored in the body system and this then contributes to the negative side effects which cause weight gain. All foods contain calories the only difference is some of these food contain higher amounts of calories than others. The usual measurement of the calorie content would be 1 gram of calorie is broken down into these following contributing measurements, carbohydrate is 4 calories, protein is 4 calories and fat is 9 calories. Most food products sold will carry the above breakdown for the shopper to have an idea of the calorie content of the item being bought for consumption purposes. Therefore in the quest to watch the calories it would be product to start taking note of the information divulged on the packaging. A fairly good guideline to go by would be that most green have comparably lower calories content to other foods. 
Often the sweetened or processed foods have very high calorie content and this is also only slightly less when it comes to the calorie content in meats. The fattier the meats the higher the calorie content therefore it would be better to opt for as much lean meat intake as possible. Most children and youngsters don't really need to watch their calorie intake if they practice very active daily routines but for the working adult without any or much physical workouts in the routine watching calories would be something to seriously consider. There are a lot of opinions on how to live a healthy lifestyle, for some it would mean eating only certain foods and following a strict diet plan, for others it would mean a lot of physical exercise and yet for others it would mean living a stress-free lifestyle. All these have its good attributes and are really quite advantages to follow but none can create a healthy lifestyle scenario by itself, ideally it should be a combination of all different positive elements complementing each other to create the healthy lifestyle. Taking small steps is often a better way to start the healthy lifestyle journey as it does entail some very significant changes. For most people who have go at it all at once, the feeling of being overwhelmed and defeated often causes them to eventually abandon any attempt to pursue a healthy lifestyle regimen. Making simple adjustments without any drastic eliminating exercises will help to encourage the individual to make further more significant changes as time goes on. These simple steps may include adding more greens and fruits to the current dietary habits. Cutting down on unhealthy processed snacks is a good step to initiate but is often very difficult as these foods are usually delicious and hard to resist as they are so fittingly named, comfort foods, however one way to doing so successfully is not having such food readily available and within easy reach. The next time the grocery shopping is done, making an effort not to add these items to the cart would be a good first step in the right direction. Another small change that can contribute towards a better lifestyle would be to incorporate some sort of exercise regimen into the daily or weekly schedule. Although a lot of people give excuses about not having the time for such activities, small changes can be made, such as learning to take the stairs whenever possible as compared to the alternative of using the elevators or escalators. People often avoid healthy food choices mainly because of the perception that these foods are normally very bland tasting and rather boring. However with some careful thought and efforts such perceptions can be changed for the better. Getting children to adapt to healthier food choices can often be a very stressful event, but if such choices were taught to be made from a very early age then the battle will not be an all-consuming as imagined. Preparing the healthier food to look and taste better would be the first way to encourage its consumption. Making conscious decision to reach for healthier options when the opportunity presents itself as a discipline that should be advocated as much as possible. For the more innovative food preparation style there are some who go a step further to actually package the healthier foods to look and feel similar to the unhealthy food choice, an example of which would be presenting celery and carrot sticks in the packaging used to present french fries. There are also some that package carrot sticks in cigarette boxes and berries in candy packaging. All these are conscious efforts made to play on the mental and visual effects of the individual, in the hope of encouraging the healthier choice being made. Making other changes gradually such as consuming brown rice and whole wheat products instead of white products is also another option to look into when making food choices. Having a couple of days dedicated to no meat consumption a week is another good start to make, and this can eventually progress to at least four days a week without meat, but this should not be done in succession as meat consumption is important to the body's needs. Adding more grains and nuts to the diet plan is also another healthy choice to make.